Hello, and welcome back to my Let's Play on Sugar 2, the Mori Small Unit Size Challenge, sponsored by my Daimyo patron, Bjorn Hellgate. Well, last time I left off, we were declared war on by the Atano. We're still aboard the Besho as well. Uh, and then there's the Urakami, which are just kind of in my way right now. Um, I don't recall exactly the best show thing. I, I watched back the last minute or so of my last episode, and I, I had the option to vassalize them, but decided not to because I wanted to take the town for myself and take the entire faction out. Now, while I agree with that assessment, that is also what I want right now. P f or <laughs> present me wants that too, if you or past me. Uh, the thing is that I don't know if we'll be able to uh, deal with all that shit, you know? I could vassalize them right now, and then and then I'm sure I can just... Well, I probably don't want to betray them at some point, but... One thing I want to see, actually, is... Um, I have better things to do than listen to see, an old woman's prattle. Speak! What, I want, what I'm thinking about doing is I, I want to get peace with them. I want to have them break their alliance with the... Uh, oh, you're allied to the Miyoshi. That's not good. I said something last time about... Them wanting to defend against the Miyoshi. What the? F Why did I say that? They're allied to the Miyoshi. They're not at war with them. They're at war with the Cheskabe, not the Miyoshi. Because I guess the Cheskabe declared war on the Miyoshi and they're allied. So, um, okay. So I don't really. I mean, yeah, that one's even worse. So let me see. But politics makes for strange and sometimes unwelcome encounters. Okay, never mind. This is this is my initial question. Do they break their alliances once they become my vassal? And I think they do. So never mind, I don't have to make them break their alliance at all. So if I make them my vassal, and then I go to war with that Urakami, then the Urakami could kill off their army, maybe even even kill off the faction, while I can take the Urakami's town with ease. Or the Urakami just attack me, but whatever. Um, but yeah, I think that might be the way to go. So I'm gonna do that. I'm going to, I don't want an alliance with you. Because you're my vassal, I want to. I want to get. Some, I, I want to see some money here. I want to see a little bit of money. Just, uh, just a little bit of a bitch koku. Oh, that's more than a bitch koku, but how about 250 kokus? How about 400 kokus? How about 350 koku? We're still in the in the part of the campaign where we need every fucking koku that we can get. Jesus, are you kidding me right now? You just fucking stingy? Holy shit, I thought they said... Wait, hold on, did I just ask 300 and then they said no and I went up to 325? Sorry. Maybe that was my bad. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Um, okay, so that should... Yes, break their alliances. Now I'm going to declare war on the Urakami, who hopefully aren't allies. No, they're not allies to anyone. I should have probably checked that beforehand, although I could have also not declared war on them, but... Hey, you guys. Hey, you guys. Uh... I want to murder you, and I want my- I want you to murder my vassal. Uh, look, there's an army right there. Go ahead and kill them. And if they do that, then I'll just run into Bison and take Bison. I don't know what they've got here, but judging from the fact that they've got both a Yard Joyard as well as a Sword School, and of course the Weaponsmith here, I've got a f sneaky feeling that this army is going to be fairly strong. And while I'm, I'm sure I can defend Bison, or sorry, Bichu, I'm not really too interested in going on the offensive against them. So I'm going to hold off on that. We can recruit a ninja, which I'd very much like to do. Let me just see. What am I currently looking at? Because I, I want to recruit units as well, I'm sure. I want to kill this army off, although it doesn't currently look like it's going to Hoki. It looks like it's going to attack this or something. I mean, I can't imagine they're going to attack me here. They certainly can't get to Mimasaka in one turn, so I think I will go on the offensive here. Uh, oh god, I've got so many buildings to build still, I, I just remember now. My economy is really not up to scratch yet. So what are we currently looking at here? We have four archers, I would like to get another two, although I should recruit those here, so let's get an archer here. What is this army at size-wise? Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen... 18, 19, and then one more archer to make it 20. All right. Um, this one would want another archer too, but I also want to build a building. Although I don't have any buildings to build, like base buildings. No, 
I just have to get roads and, and such. Um, and of course the archery dojo here. I don't have enough money unfortunately for this, that would have been a decent buy I suppose. Um, yes, ships, that's the thing, I need to keep building ships. We are being besieged here currently. Or I wouldn't say besieged, but blockaded. Build some ships there too. We had some ships going here. Boom, 600 bucks from that. The trade goes to Aki, I guess? No. It goes here, yet we're being... Oh, I guess I'm not being... They're not blockading me. They're just sitting right there. That's weird. Uh, and then we had some ships over here. And they, I think, were going down here. There's still the option of taking this, but I believe that was being owned by someone. God remembers. Can't remember who exactly, but it was definitely someone who owned that. Okay. Um, I do want to recruit a ninja, but I think I'd rather get some road upgrades. So let's get the roads in Mimasaka for... No, let's not do that. I was going to say for no apparent reason, but we should... No, yeah, actually, yeah, let's do that. Could get that replenishment as well. Right, now I don't know how this fight's going to go, but... Wait, if we were to attack with you, do they reinforce? They do. Alright, let's attack with you. Fuck me. I could do a night attack and not have my reinforcements join me. How about that? Alright, so we have two Katana Sam and five Yari Sam and one Boat Ashigaru. Now, normally, you all know me. I'd be laughing at this army. Fucking laughing at it. But not not right now. I mean, I'm still laughing because let's be let's be frank. But only if I can be Bob. Um, Bob. Let's be let's be let's be fair. The the amount of archers we have we should just tear them apart. Um, so they will be attacking me. So they will run into my Yari wall. And the the point I was going to make is that normally I'd be laughing because Yari Ashigaru beat Yari Samurai. Uh, no. I don't want fog, actually. But in this particular case... <laughs> I forgot about this. We got two men in here now, though. We got one extra dude. Protect your daimyo! Um, yeah, but in this case, uh, because the Yari uh, wall is so iffy... I'm not actually too happy about this, is, is what I was trying to say all along. Right, this gives me four fairly solid units. And then, yeah, okay, that's that's good. This is my line. This is America. Um, oh, and I have you guys as well. How about that? And a general. And this one retainer. Couldn't afford anymore. They're just going to sit there. Well, that's totally fine by me. I shall move up. Oh yeah, we have, we have reinforcements. So I ought to get them in as well. You're fairly far away, but you will be somewhat useful in this battle, so just run, actually. Oh, hello, oh, oh, god, god, stop, stop. Okay, you guys are all still on loose, or on, uh, not on loose formation, on fire at will. I don't even know if it's worth firing at their archer, I think I should just do as much damage to their infantry as possible. Preferably their Katana Sam. Like that. I may need to just run these guys up front. Oh, right, we have Stand and Fight. Forgot about that. Alright, I want you all in Yari Wall. Actually, just put everyone in Yari Wall. Not these two. And not you. I'm glad I ran this unit over, because it's going to be a fucking while before it gets there. You are not blocked. You can fire that unit easily. Oh, we already have some routing. No, we don't. I was going to say, that would be ridiculous. That would be ridiculous. Don't be silly. We have routing going on. Yep. The whole army is routing. We won. Who defunct it? Who defunct it? Who defunk it? Soon the glorious victory is mine. Not yet, but... Oh, no, it's mine. Right now, actually. 
All right. Please allow me to end this battle. Hey, you've arrived. Wow, they're not even tired yet. Guess it wasn't that far. Well, that was easy. This I I don't have any other words. That's it. That was easy. It's just it, this campaign is still so funny to me. It has been about a week or so since I last recorded, maybe longer. This campaign, but it's just funny. Like it's such a weird thing because you'd think it'd be so much more difficult. But it's, the, the, like the campaign map is. I don't know if it's more difficult than a regular legendary campaign. I think Mori is one of the tougher clans, to be fair. But, um, like, the, the 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 battles are just such a piss take. I don't know. It, maybe they seem like a piss take when they're not really. But I don't know. It just seems easier to me. From here, we can reach the Hoki if this army does indeed go this way. Although, if it does, I would like to see them go towards Harima. I would I would love it if they take Harima and then I just take Bichu or Bizen, Sorry. And then this army is dead, or yeah, my vassal's dead, which gained us uh, an honor as well, by the way, which is useful. Although it looks like no, we have six right now. Perfect. Um, yeah, and then and then they own that, and then perfect. You know, we can just we can just murder them. But for now, I'm gonna keep this army here. I can go to Inaba next turn if these guys either sit here or whatever, and I can go to Mimisaka if they seem to be going that way. Although Mimisaka is currently unhappy, although it won't be forever. In fact, they'll be happy next turn. How about that? Oh, wait, wait, do we have a Mirror of Amaterasu? Yeah, we do. Reflection of Amaterasu. So it actually is going to be minus one next turn, but the turn after it'll be Ziddle. So it's okay. Right, then. Then I... Sh well, yeah, let's keep upgrading the roads here anyway. I was going to upgrade them here instead now, because otherwise I won't get the replenishment, but... Eh. Whatevs. I, I shouldn't upgrade them here, then. I should just upgrade them elsewhere, like Aki, my capital... Probably where I've got most of the movement as well. Maybe these two, but... Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, we're working on Heaven and Earth. Seems a bit early. I think I said that last time too. Not sure why I'm already going for that. But I've put in the time. May as well finish it, I suppose. Oh, the replenishment. Yeah, actually the replenishment would be useful. Okay. Uh, ships. We've done all the movements that we could do. Recruitment. Money is spent. Yep. Sounds good. I really ought to make this into a trading port. That's why the trade's going there, by the way, because that's the only trading port we have. I just realized. Or remembered. Hey, thanks, bud. Um, should I join you? If I don't, will you still win? Yeah, you probably will. Good luck. Thank you. Oh, nice. They lost almost all their ships from that as well. They actually gained some, and then they fought the last ship that ran away, and they lost everything again. So that worked out. Fucking Millhouse for me. Came up Millhouse. Oh, here they come! Perfect! This is what we wanted! Oh god, that's... No, that's not a problem. This is what, what I wanted. I was hoping that they would come out and attack me, because then I can just kill them, and I can run over and take their town. Uh, army's not as good as I was thinking it might be, which is good. They uh, don't have all the... Oh! Shh! Shit, though, the Besho come out. Oh my god, if, if the Besho takes that town, which I'm sure they can reach it, after I kill this army off, I'll be severely disappointed. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh my god, I may have to betray my fucking vassal real soon here. If they take that town, I'm gonna fucking cry. Oh, please, Besho. Why didn't you move before? Why didn't you move before the, this faction? Why are you one. They're like straight after as well. It doesn't make any sense. They're 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 higher on the fucking alphabetical order. It's B versus U. Come on. This is bullshit. Anyway. Uh no hiding from the archers here. They had four, right? Oh, we have the guns in this one. I forgot about that. Okay, this castle I don't really fight on very often. I don't remember where the AI tends to come from. I think it's usually here, and then sometimes here. I'm gonna put my range units. Like here for now. Yeah, let's split you up a little bit. Um, alright. No stand and fight for you. Well, it's. Well, there's the generals and the one Yari Sam. There's a couple dudes. There's a couple dudes. 
Yeah, well, there's just okay. Well, they're all over the shop, so. Actually, no. Uh, yeah, just go there for now. I want the gunman where they have a couple good units, so that's free Ari Sam, so I want you right there. I'll put one of you right here, and one of you right here. So, where are their archers at? That's what we really need to know. To it's Bonbo Ashigaru and to Yari Ashigaru. Oh, that's for you, you bow units, okay. Well, I've put two archers against the three. We should technically win that. Since, you know, we're defending and all, but... Unfortunately, they got the first volley off because I didn't set them up properly and they were actually really close to me already. I could bring this unit over there as well. And then freebie freedom, but... Okay, they're moving up for some reason. That's good. It's not full units either. Uh, let me start dividing my forces here a little bit. We have no melee units coming from here. There are some here, some here, some here. Okay, let's do this. And then the samurai retainer. And the generals. So the archers are here and there. So let's put you guys over here. Make sure I protect you. Don't get shot. It's not fantastic, but sure. Right, you guys look like you're winning. Guns, are you almost in range yet? Almost. Here comes this unit. Here we go. This is going to be fun. Goodbye, Yari Samurai. That was actually a lot more effective than I thought it was going to be. I mean, I knew it was going to be effective, but killing half of a fucking Yari Sam unit is pretty nice. Pretty nice. You really killed like only three dudes so far. What the hell have you been doing? Oh, not guard. Alright, you have to pull off there as well. Let's get you over here. Why are you not in Yari's fucking... They keep being... Sh they, they, they're getting shot and then they lose their formation or something. I don't know what the fuck's up with that. Guns... Uh, we're having a field day and then... I managed to get them attacked, which wasn't very smart. Let's get them out of here because these guys will probably have terrible replenishment. Since I can't recruit them. Get out of there! Here, we killed one. Second one is wavering. Yeah, we're definitely winning that fight. No need to be concerned. I totally forgot to charge the uh, these dudes in there, but it looked like they're winning anyway. Not that I would have expected anything else. I want you to help out here. I don't like how this fight's going here. In fact, we're being kind of overrun here. Well, that isn't very smart. Uh, gunmen. Men of the guns, would you mind coming over here and firing your guns at those men right there? Uh, Yara Samurai dudes, come over here. You gotta stay here against... Nah, eh, fuck it, we'll deal with them later. Oh god, I'm actually losing some men here. I don't like it. I don't like losing men. I would prefer if we don't. Okay, they're shattered up. Probably gonna shatter that. There you go. That unit too. You're not gonna be... Oh god, this unit's almost dead. Oh no, you're actually gonna... Yeah, you're dead. Wow, we lost a unit. I suppose this was a fairly tough battle, but still. Didn't have to lose any men. That wasn't necessary either. Get on the wall. Shoot those general men. You're 2 v wanting that unit now. You are... Well, 1v1 because this unit took... Or went off the wall. Alright, this didn't go particularly well, honestly. We lost a unit. Which, in and of itself, is pretty bad. These guys are not going to have a very fun time climbing the wall. Actually, you know what? I should put a gun unit up here. You know what? I'll put them here. I'll let them climb, and then I'll let them take a volley from the fucking gun unit. Wait. 
Do I hear archer fire, or is that just these guys firing down? I mean, a hard time killing them, to be honest. Gunmen are almost there. Okay, get off. Uh, I want my summer retainer unit. What the fuck's going on here? Well, I mean, if you're here, may as well kill that unit real quick. Don't route before you take a volley from my gunmen, please. Who are still reloading, by the way. Impressive reload times. Here we go. How, how sad is that? You just uh, yeah, we're finally at the top. Oh shit! There's fucking gunmen firing at us. I should like to kill our generals off entirely if we could. But I'll just end it. I don't know if that's going to work that way or not. But for science, we will see. They were in my castle. I'm pretty sure the game doesn't go as far as to think, oh, those units were in the castle, so they would have died. But hey, it's worth finding out, isn't it? Isn't it? Yeah, we lost that unit. I'm pretty sure it died in its entirety anyway, so... No real question about that one. We have 23 men remaining. No general, so yeah, they did die. Good. Now, they didn't get taken out by the best show. Thank God for that. Because that would have been incredibly sad. This army probably could have reached it. Yeah, it looks like it could have. Not sure why they didn't, in all honesty. In partial honesty. Right, let's get you guys over here. Good luck on your travels. Oh, we got stopped by quite a large force. Let's build some more ships and send them out later. Wait, that's not the one I want. You're not the one that I want. You are not the one that I want. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Not the one that I want. Let's see if that's still taken. Right, let's uh, let's have the fun shit happen, shall we? Kill this unit. Goodbye. I lost three men, are you kidding me? I guess it was an archer unit, so I suppose it makes some sense. Alright, infantry leader, please. That's not bad. Yeah, I'll take that. I'll take the risk. Singular general. This looks like it's tough. It shouldn't be. Oh my god, you've got to be kidding me right now. I should have just attacked it. Right, well I do want the uh, summer, the sword school here, so I guess I'll keep it. Can't recruit them because you need a military port, which is unfortunate because it means you can never recruit them here. <sighs> so I'd have to basically take... Um, Satsuma. I don't even think Kaga has a port. No, so Kaga doesn't work either. If I want them upgraded, that is. I think the only ones... Wait, no, there's Satsu uh, Shu Musashi here. Is that... No, Sagami. Does that have a port? I think it does. It doesn't show here, but I'm pretty sure Sagami has a port, but I'm pretty sure I'm not going to wait that long. It's more likely we'll recruit them here, or just recruit them without upgrades, but... I don't know. I only lost two fucking units though, that's a bit sad. Then again, I probably will start replacing them with Katana Samurai anyway, so it, it's probably okay. Ish. Right, well, that's dealt with, so... Let's go to Inaba. Take that shit. Can you not be in my way, please? Okay, if this is also a fight where I lose a bunch of units... Oh, they have two fucking Katana Samurai in there. Uh, I mean, if, uh, please. Okay, I was gonna say. My daimyo dies there, I'd be pretty upset. I think I might just keep the market here. Okay. This is a trading port, so if we get a military port here, we can start recruiting. Well, no, we need the sword school as well, actually. Could go for the Naman trade port. Allows me to recruit much like a Shigaru. A lot of people have been commenting about the fact that I should go for guns, which I still don't think I will. Um, or not specifically, anyway. I could get this for the import of much like a Shigaru, which I think you don't need a gunsmith for. It's just, you know, just a Naman trade port. Um, but if I were to go any further, I would, I would, or any other units, I would have to go for a gunsmith and much like Samurai. I mean, it's good in this campaign because you could spread them out thin, but it, I don't think it's that good. 
Uh, and either way, I, I don't think I'm going to go for an Amma trade port because I would have to fight the Christianity pretty fucking hard. And I don't... I can't really be bothered right now. So, that's the main reason. Uh, are you going to catch up to them or are you just going to sit here? I think you're just going to sit here. We'll build up a bit of a force here in case these guys decide to get any ideas. Although we have an army here, but still. Do you recruit any units or just wait for Katana Sam? I think I might wait for them. Do I want the Weaponsmith? Do I want to go full on... Uh, melee attack or armor? <laughs> or a bit of both. There's always an option. Um, I'm half tempted to go for a Weaponsmith since we already have... The thing is though, I think I said in, in some at some point that Bow Warrior Monks are going to be what I want to go for. Which would indicate that I want to go... Heavy on the defense, but maybe I'll go for. I don't know. Maybe I don't know what to go for. Maybe that's it. I think I'll just go aggressive and then also have Bow Warrior Monks, which don't really work together very well, but fuck it. It's interesting, right? Something different for once. What else do we do? We build a sake then, and we got the farm upgraded. Great. Dude, are all my farms upgraded right now? Yeah, so one of them is being upgraded as we speak, but yes, essentially. Who Did I already level you up? Yeah, that was you. Okay. Lost two fucking units, what a bullshit. Actually, yeah, this works out pretty well then. If we get the Yari... Sorry, not the Yari Joy Art. The, um... Heaven Nerf, which means in three turns we can make the encampment. It's gonna take like seven turns or something to actually get that fully upgraded. Then we gotta get this as well. Seven turns plus the three turns, we gotta wait for that. So ten turns plus this. Um but then we uh we will we will have fully upgraded units already coming out of here, which is not bad. Right anyway. I'm just a little bit confused right now. Diplomacy, yes, that's what I thought. We'd have some trade available. With some people that hate me. How about you guys? No. How about you guys? Yes. Who else? No. No. Alright. Looks like we don't have much of a choice here. I'll take your trade. And you will pay me. The Chosukabe. I don't think I've ever heard that line. I don't remember it anyway. I guess I don't really open diplomacy with the Chosukabe very often, but still. Anyway, 250 will have to do. Alright, so I do know I want another archer from here. Just trying to remember what units I wanted. I think I want some archers in here as well, which I can just get. So let's do that. We can't. Well, we can, but we can't. So let's get him here. And then, building wise, we have enough money to upgrade this. So I think we should start getting or start working on that. I also want to upgrade Hoki at some point soonish. Oh my god, what happened to my income? When did that change so drastically? The fuck? What the fuck? It's gonna go even further next turn when we get that shit. Did my trade somehow just fucking... Yeah, there was a lie about that 300 and something. There's 477. I don't know what changed exactly, but... Still though, we were on like 1900 or something, and then all of a sudden we're 3500. What the fuck? Anyway, uh, don't I have... cannot afford a Metsuke, hold on. I can get one. I'm tempted to do so and cancel this archer for it. Where is the nearest I can get one? Actually, where, which is my richest town I should have a look at? Akiwami Inaba, all the way in the east. Alright, we can get one here, how about that? Cash me outside, how about that? Uh, Alright, I think next turn we are going to keep moving on, just to take the next town and then take out the fucking Natano. I don't... I think I talked about this, I don't really want to go further than this. Why... is that the first... oh no, they own Tamba. So maybe I have to take out Tajima and get a piece of them or something. I don't really want to go further than these two towns. And then I probably want to head west instead. Start fucking these guys over, the Shoni, Sagara, Shimazu. And that's it. And the ouchie, but those were these guys, so, you know. 
Anyway. Uh, I imagine they would take peace now, actually. But I won't, so, you know, there's that. And this disgusting turn. What would you want from the Chosukabe? Or something? It is tempting to build the Naman trade port, though. I mean, having those match looks early on, especially, but even late game, it's just kind of insane, to be honest, how good they are in this particular challenge. Hello. Oh, shit. I can't imagine I saw... Or I can't say that I saw that one coming. But okay. Oh, yeah, both samurai. Well, anyway. Fine. I will murder you next time. Uh, until then, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good day and goodbye.